right, so we got the six millimeter arc. zero to one to six LPVO first. I'm gonna do that at the 15 yards. And then I think the red dot we gonna do at a 10 yard. So this one is going to be done at 10 yards. Red dot, I mean, which you can shoot the red dot up to 100 yards. But I want to use the red dot for close targets. And then I want the six to stretch out to the 100 or 200. Grindel mag is feeding good.
So I think I do like the red dot in front and not behind. Yeah. Be pretty much for the 16 yards. I'm out of ammo anyway, that's about 25 rounds, and I think we got it good enough. Confirm it out with the 50, move on to the 100, up to the 200. Alright, so mostly all these guns on here without a light will be size small. And they all fit an optic. We're gonna go through a few of these real quick. So this is the size small, this is the size large, and I'll grab a medium, but let's just start with 502. But yeah, I just want to show what they look like inside of it. So that's the 502 in the small. Then we got the SAR 9 in a small. MC9 in a small. Masada IWI in a small. The XDM, was the XD, XDM 10 in a small, and that's with the suppressor height sights. Nothing is scratching the lens on the optics, so you ain't gotta worry about that. What else we didn't check? What is this? Ruger 57 in a small. I think this one right here. What is this? A PX9 and a small. The 510 and the 509, all of that's the same. I don't want to take those lights off. All of those is the same in a small because they basically built like this. Nine long slide in a small. DP9 in a small. Sig P320 in a small. All of these guns in small. So that's with the O-Light in the large with the optic steel. This one is 545 with a, with a Streamlight TLR7 in the large now these bigger guns like this with these suppressor high sights these lights is more ideal with the uh with the suppressor high sights so you can clear those so 509 with the big light it is stretching it you definitely stretching it on that edge with the suppressor high sights so some of these bigger lights is stretching it but if you use in guns with the regular size sight with the big lights that should be good but when you got these suppressor height sights it can cause clearance issues on certain lights and so lights we tested that's not on these guns right now sig foxtrot data fit pl turbo valkyrie o light nightstick on these big suppressor height sights i might run a smaller light like this so i can clear Yeah, I'll run something like a setup like this so I can clear it like that. See, that was easy. So 
If I'm running a big light like one of those, I would probably choose something slimmer. Uh, well, bigger light, I'm gonna use a smaller gun, something like the Masada or a Glock 19, something a little more slimmer. Because the Hellcat goes in a small, so here's a medium like that. So compact, well, I guess they call these micro. Micro size guns with the uh, sub light goes in the medium. Guns with lasers like the Taurus with the Viridian laser will go in this medium. Magazine, holsters, bolts. Motivation, I see your movement is in effect, and I fucking love that shit. Let's get it. I see your motivation, I see your movement is in effect, and I fucking love that shit. <laughs>